Welcome back to Let's Play Banjo Tooie. I'm your host, Old Director Jester, with the Nisco. It's, time, we... it's time for us to move on to the next level. Are we out of the mine? We are out of the mine. Good. But we gotta go back at some point. <laughs> back into the mine. Oh. We got a black Jinjo. Well, that's not too bad. See, I was hoping we wouldn't have to, like, dive directly back into the mine from a different vantage point. See that up there? If I can just... Oh, get... you gotta shoot a fireball. Yeah. Yep. For that is the way to level three. Have we even opened the way to level three? This is the way to level three. No, I mean, like, how, have we met up with our, our boy Jiggy Wiggy? Yes. We, okay. did, we did two at once. Yeah, that's it was, right. It was a theme park. Okay. <gasps> We're gonna have a theme park? Yeah! Gonna go see some clowns? Well, they're already right here. What? Look, I was trying to insult the witch sisters. Oh, and I, I insulted us instead. Oh. Well, then again, that's that is, that's that's insulting the clowns. Bring in the clowns! Honk honk. So we uh make our way in here. <laughs> she gonna turn us into a clown? <laughs> oh no! Wow, Banjo was walking on nothing. This is a special wigwam for Wumba. We need the legendary Mega Globo, though. You know how hard it is to find? How hard is it to find? It's stop and swap based. Oh, really? This is what the ice key is for. The ice key unlocks a safe that has the Mega Globo. That old... <laughs> Oh yeah, it's it's great. It it mm -hmm. you can look it up yourself and find out, but you better not tell him. So I want him to be surprised. By da -da 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 -da. Anyway, learn something else. We got fire eggs. No time for grenade eggs. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I like it. No fucking oranges here. <laughs> Just shitting grenades. Oh dear. Oh. Hey, you got the rare one again. <laughs> how, how do you, soldier? It's, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The war is over. Yeah, yeah, right. You can go home. All right, this is the third level. Witchy World. The happiest place on Earth. The most miserable theme park ever. All right, the most miserable place on Earth. Uh, the most miserable pl- oh... No, oh, no, not one of those. They're killing the staff? Yeah. What's wrong with you? So you can just shoot one uh, of these can, and... Good, oh uh, my god! There we go. That's how grenade eggs work. Kazooie's packing! Oh, is that a mascot? Yeah, he's- he's-, he's don't worry about it. Like, like, is that Witchy World's equivalent of Cinderella or he, something like that? He's insured, don't worry. <laughs> the employees have insurance? couple of notes up here. Uh, I kind of like this level. It's it's about as long and as big as the mine. In fact, bigger. But the thing is, it's sectioned off, so it's easier to tell where landmarks are and stuff. Oh, okay. Aw, oh, they reuse the Christmas lights it's, from uh, the winter place. It's, it's more open, too. That's a big plus for me. Yeah. Oh, there's gambling in Witchy World. <laughs> That's so, how you know that this place isn't on the up and up. Sign me up. Uh, one of, the, one of the worst things about this is figuring out where to start. I guess here's a good place to start. Finally get to this. The split up <gasps> skill! Oh! This is where Banjo and Kazooie finally split up. Oh, it's so sad! I know, They're, I know. They were such a good team together! But we need, we need to support them in their, in their time apart, though. I guess, but I mean, I... <sighs> I, I kind of don't like both of them, so I'm taking. You don't like either of them? No, I like them. I'm kidding. I like I, I like Kazooie at least. You know, she. I, I take back my Christmas card. <laughs> <laughs> that was a misinput, by the way. I figured, I figured oh, you're you you're keeping count again. I'm not keeping count, but I'm just pointing them out. Hey, because so, uh, uh, I can't tell anymore what's a misinput and what was intentional. Well, you did it so long ago. Ah! I saw that file. I saw the last time you played this. <laughs> Speaking of which, uh, how far are you in doing this game? I have not gotten that far. Okay. I've been too busy working on other projects. I got Metroid maps to plan out. 
But I'm running out. I'm, ra I'm running out of episodes. I need to start. I think I need to get back into it this week. There's spring shoes and a Jin Joe. Was that red? Yes. Uh, maybe orange. Burger. L looks kind of ready. Uh, the burger, the burger and fries joint. We don't have anything to do with right now because we don't have the skill required to you get the. some notes. I know we're gonna get them though. Trust me, we're gonna get as much as we can. I love how you mentioned you didn't have the power up to deal with the burgers and fries. Do you turn into a bottle of ketchup later? <laughs> Nothing like that. Okay, good. Oh lord. Uh, time for the 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 top dive. Oh. What kind of diving board is this? They cut out all of it. Well, I was just thinking it was a test of strength, like you were gonna go down and hit the bell. Ew. All right, all right. Oh, There's God. one of two ways to do this. Oh, God. <laughs> Can either carefully, carefully make a <laughs> or just do that. Oh. That's a lot easier. Yeah, that's that's way easier. In fact, it's the smarter option, I'd say. <laughs> What you don't you don't want to defy death? I'll defy death uh, just like that. Cause there are notes in there. And now Banjo and Kazooie will dive into the singular cup of water. This teaspoon of vinegar. See, I never understood that that sideshow act. It's like, I'm gonna dive into a cup of water, and you see the Looney Tunes do it because, duh, they're cartoons. Well, yeah. But who would actually fall for that? It's people of, like, the 1940s when that was, you know, impressive. With diving into a cup of water? N now I found an AGT guy where a guy just dumps into a kiddie pool full of water from, like, 50 feet. And belly he first. And he survived? And lived! He did it on television! Wow. Yeah! <laughs> Is that the toilet? Ripping paper. There. Oh my god, they're back! Yeah, more of these things. Almost like that's a visual cue that you gotta climb up here more than the actual crack itself, you know? No, hey, hey. Simmer down now. Easy there, boys. All this to get to... a switch. Which that switch? up the train. Yep. Alright, build drill doesn't work. <laughs> Oh, hey, cool! Does the train come in? Oh, the train is late. I think there's something you can pull to, like, summon the train. Hmm, okay. But we don't need we don't need to right now. We uh, just gotta stay here in Witchy World. No burgers and fries here. Not yet. I guess. Oh, uh, do you have any money? Uh, you know, not yet. Is that what we turn into? <laughs> Soon we'll have so much money we will not know what to do with it. It will become useless to us because we have so much money. Meanwhile, in a snake way... Again, this is where they... Oh, it's all dark. Isn't it tough? But if, no. bright, if your brightness is up high, high enough, it really isn't. Are those ghosts chasing you? Sorta. I think they're just kind of meandering around. Lost souls, as it were. Ah, the prison. Check out who this guy is. You blew him up. Oh wait. Oh, it's the is the camel dude. It's Gobi. What's he doing in prison? Good question. Yeah, well, in the first game, he's you know the last time we saw him, he was going to head to the lava world, but there was no lava world for him to go to, so he just wasn't there. And now he's going to the lava world. So now here he is in the second game, locked up, and, well, I, I, I can guarantee this will not be the last time that we see Gobi. What we got over there, and, uh, oh, uh, he hello there. Are you tricky? Probably, you probably a sister or something. Uh, Trikey. I'm glad you remind me of Tricky, because every time I think of Star Fox Adventures, and I go, that was a good game! Then I remember Tricky. Oh. Well. I... Uh, Use me! I'm a three-horn! That's, that's, that's Hey, Fox! Uh, hey, hey, Tricky. Hey, 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 how you doing? You wanna do a blunt? Uh, y you know, that's alright. You know, I gotta drive, and you know, I got work in the morning. I, I, I just can't. Crystal's kind of a bitch! Do you, you know what? I think you can leave. Sorry to do this to you, Tricky. 
So we've so we've unlocked uh, the door there, but she won't leave until the train's ready, which is fine. Is that Bottle's kid? No, this is one of Boggy's kids. Freeze easy peek. Crying for presents. Again? His mom's here now, taking him to the witchy world. And oh, so... They've, <laughs> they've all ran off, and... All three of these little... There are three brats running around, uh -huh. and all three of them... won't come home with you. I, I, think, I think one will, but the other two need food, and the third one needs the special skill we don't have, because he's too fucking fat. I actually love that we helped out the single dad in Free Easy Peak. Who's that single dad? His his mom's here. Her their 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 their, their mom is here. I know, but they could be, you know, apart. You don't know their marital status. I mean, Banjo Kazooie split up, and we thought they'd last forever. It's a page. Yay. Yeah, two more we can- oh, well, 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 okay, okay, that's why this- that's why the sides are sharp. You need to be careful when you jump from ledges like that. And... I thought they were just, like, for show. I didn't think they actually had collision detection on them. Well, at least we got what we needed out of that. Tickets, please. Uh, no tickets, I guess. It's a free-for-all. <sighs> and this is why we can't have nice things. Because the bears took over this area. <laughs> oh, them bears. The Chicago bears. Mm hmm Yeah. The country bears. Yes. Oh, the money truck is here. The money truck. Cactus <laughs> strength. This one's kind of interesting. So Good, kinda. If I can just kinda jump the right way. Right. There we uh, go. There we go. And I knew that. I knew that was gonna happen. Hmm. Could tell you that was gonna happen with my eyes closed. I want you to play the rest of this level with your eyes closed. Uh, okay, it's going to be about a three hour long video, though. Well, that's okay, because I can tell you what's happening on screen. <laughs> You're losing! You're losing! Watch out for the Loch Ness Monster, it's right there in the middle of Witchy World! So we could tightrope walk her up. Well, well, well just... okay. I guess we're just, I guess we're just doing that. This is how Banjo tightrope walks. It's not as impressive, but way safer. <laughs> He's a big old cheater. Yeah, it's not as impressive, but way safer. Let me just, uh, boop this button up here. Go. Uh -huh. Well, that's... Conve- oh. Aww. Hey, well, oh. That still works out, because what we need to do is just... Oh. Camera, camera, camera. Oh. Camera. 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 Don't need to come up here, though. Maybe it is better that you're playing this with your eyes closed. Because right now we just met the Elvis impersonator here in Witchy World. And he is so good, baby. This is just a, a way to get across over here. Over the tent, you get to see the whole, the whole of Witchy World. You can see what I mean by sectioned off. There's a space world, there's a lava world, there's a Man. cave world. Yeah, this level is long. At least maneuvering around is a bit easier. It's a lot more stimulating than the mine was. I hated the mine. It just went Let's on go. and on and on. There we go. Ding. All right. All right, all right. We could do a couple things from up here. What should we try? Yeah, we'll just... Head back the old-fashioned way, then. And if you look to your left, you can see the rest of Witchy World. Oh. And if you look to your front, you'll see we just ran into the wall. Sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. There's a ginger over there. What if I can maybe jump right into him? Oh. Yeah, we'll try this, then. This is the cactus strength. Yep. Need three moves to make it work. The Bill Drill. The regular Slam. And... A Grenade Egg. Really? Yeah. How is that a test of strength? Well, grenades are really strong. <laughs> and they're mine grenades, <laughs> so therefore, <laughs> I am really strong. You rigged the game, though! <laughs> Ow. 
effect. Boy, they don't uh, mess around on the fall damage here, do they? Yeah. I really like that Banjo can now be tried for rigging carnival games. <laughs> you know, the ones that are already rigged. Uh... Yeah, and he was convicted on like three counts of murder. How the hell was it murder? He didn't even kill anybody. Well, the, the jury was rigged too. Everything is rigged. Like if he goes to the gambling part of Witchy World, he's leaving there with negative money. <laughs> you have to like sell his shorts. Sad, really. Can you get in debt with coupons? Apparently you can in Witchy World. <laughs> Give me all your coupons. I got a coupon for uh, <laughs> crippling debt. <laughs> <laughs> I got 50% off crippling debt! Yeah! Oh, here we go. Alright, now we're getting some links here. I don't think we have a Globo, though. And I, Oh, because it's in here. Well, there we go. So, uh, Wumba, let me just uh, give you the Globo here. You can turn us into something... Incredible. What are we going to be? <laughs> a clown. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll let the magic unfold. Okay. Go, magic, go. It was obvious we were a money truck. What? We're a money truck! Why? Because amusement parks are rigged, you need a lot of money, to get around, so no, here we are. No. Yeah. Why is Banjo the money truck? So we can go through these doors. Okay. Go down here and back up again. Uh huh. We can drive around, jump, you know, slam things. It's pretty cool like that. Knock those things out and get their ah tickets. <laughs> Wait. Ticket? Oh, to, to get prizes? They're, they're basically uh, final boss tickets. Oh, okay. <laughs> that guy was just sitting there, dude! <laughs> you took him out! Certainly unique in terms of transformations go, but uh, better than the plunger. At least here, I don't die by doing my move. You know, I, I know you were talking about a TNT plunger. But for a hot second there, I thought you meant, like, toilet plunger. I, I know, I heard the words, and I thought of plunger, too. Hmm. And we make our way in here, and there's a Jinjo! Come with me, sir, your family is safe. Well, I mean, when I find them. Welcome to Banjo Brink's service. Give me all your cash. <laughs> whole bunch of places. I always hate starting these levels because you gotta go around and do this thing and where's that? I'll do over here make this part easier. And See, now you know how how my mind works when I'm playing Donkey Kong 64. Well, I don't have to juggle five Kongs at once, though, when I'm doing it, so but that's... But you uh, do have a lot of setup for payoff later. It is true. So here's what the big thing is for. Pay here, here's where we get the money. The fearsome furnace of the inferno. Or the Inferno. So was that just a silver turd or something like that? Just a, I, I, I don't know. Maybe it was one of Kazooie's eggs. <laughs> uh, oh. Oh. Oh, well. I don't know why they made the door like this. <laughs> just kind of want to go through there, thank you. There we go. No trucks allowed on the ride. Oh. This, this, this seems a little bit unsafe for, uh... Uh, just a wee bit. Well, th there's that Baki kid over there. There's, there's the fat fuck that won't get out. Uh, okay, so you could just drive in the lava. Could drive in lava here, that's oh, good. Oh, that's good. What you, make up for, what, what you lose in mobility, you make up for in durability. Apparently, I'm surprised your rubber tires aren't melting. There is Mumbo's Globo. Okay. Or what is... Supposed to be Mumbo's Globo. There's a warp point. Warp That's to get good. here. And here's Fat Fuck. Oh. Switch to hit, but we can't really. I mean, we could do it, but. This just creates a little ramp for you oh, to run up here. Oh, this is a race. Stage. Yeah. Oh, oh. There's only one person. 
And Who can do it? That's why you have to break them apart. That's right. Banjo sits on the on the pad. Kazooie does the running. Oh god. <laughs> they were such a good couple of cards. Well, now uh, they're even though they're apart, they're still working together. That's good, at least. All right, where to now? So many places to go to. I haven't even checked out the space section yet. All right, we'll check out the space area. Then. What's your favorite amusement park that you've been to? Cedar Point. Okay. Something about roller coaster capital of the world, and I'm still holding on to that for so long. But if you love if you love, if you love roller coasters, Cedar Point is the place to go because they have just so many of them. Wasn't Cedar Point the one that recently lost a coaster? Or was that Six Flags? Everybody loses a coaster at some point. Well, that's true. It depends on what you mean by lose a coaster. As in, shut down permanently. That happens a lot. I mean, there's... I don't know what gets shut down a lot. I mean, there was the disaster transport, that's gone. There was the, uh... The, the, the... The raptor, that's gone too. The raptor's gone, yeah, I remember that. It's kind, of, it's kind of sucked because I liked I, I liked the raptor because you could like let your feet dangle. Meanwhile, the uh, the, the mantis is when we have to stand up and it always makes my legs explode. So here's how the split up works: you just sit on the pad and there you go. Whoa! Oh no! Okay. So you can't just swap whenever you want to. You have to swap at certain points. Whenever there's like sparkling around there, uh huh. You can then swap to your partner. So we'll have Banjo walk over here in his, uh, distressingly empty backpack. Oh, it's so sad. There's your swap cloud. Ah! Ouchie, ouch. Oh, you split your life in half. Yeah, Kazooie only has four hits. And you somehow lost one. Because I got hit before we came up here. So, here we go. Throw in the shoes and off we go! Anyway, uh, we can just go up here and uh, roast turkey. Am I right? And go 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 go! go. Oh, all right, all right. Don't okay. die. Don't die. Don't die. Trying. Oh, well. And well, nice try, Kazooie. <laughs> I got a new bird. <laughs> Secretly, she has always been a pet bird, never a partner, only <laughs> a pet. Oh no, they were always partners, but how far they were partners, we didn't have to know until today. Find uh, out tonight on E! True Hollywood Story. I like how Mumbo's skull is like a devil, because it's he's like in the inferno and all that. Yeah. Alright, go! Go, 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 run, 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 jumpy <laughs> jump! Uh, run, 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 jumpy jump, man, that jumping. Can you just jump really like shit? Fuck! No, you can't. How fuck! Do you, how do you. Oh my god! Fuck, fuck! How do you do this? Carefully. Well, careful's not your repertoire. It can be. Okay, so you jump normally. There we go. Yeah, stopping and jumping seems to help because you get the you know a higher jump from it. They're actually laughing at you, leaving you hot and bothered. It is a great thing I did not spend two hours on this because that laughing would have killed me. <laughs> yes. Go. And then. Spring up like that. Whoa! Oh, yeah, well, 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 yeah, yeah, there's oh, your thing. There you go. All right, now die. Got to jump off from this. No! Yeah! Boom! <laughs> Jesus! That bird went splat. They actually had a special animation for that too. <laughs> Damn. Harsh. Right now, I think would be a good time to check in on Mumbo and see what he's up to. I'm glad you're not dead, Kazooie. That would have sucked. <laughs> I'm I'm upset you're not, Banjo. <laughs> it's a kind kind of a one-sided love-hate relationship. <laughs> I know that makes no logical sense. Oh well, a free one, thanks. Yoink. All right, I think I think we can get a new uh, a new health upgrade next time we get a chance. Ooh. All right, Mumbo, take the Globo and go and hit pads and do stuff and basically turn on the park. So he's like the manager. Yeah, Mumbo has been delegated to just walk around, hit the pads, and turn things on. 
Every once in a while you get like he did with the with the gigantic statue in the first level. But but even then, he's turning things on. He's opening the doors. Mm -hmm. He's he's defeating certain enemies. Here he's definitely turning stuff on. I, I don't like how his 3D model looks. It's very niche. Uh, uh, no, no. He's a walking, talking skull. He doesn't need eyeballs. There's a bit of innocence to him in his uh, regular model here, but in the one that he used for his face, it, just, it looks kind of unnatural. But it is cool that his pad still has his old face. Oh, it does? Yeah. <laughs> so now the now the Dodgem Dome is up. Uh Mumbo has the power of Thor. Summon lightning! So that part of the park is open, ready to go. Uh next. Oh, that's a Teach me move. Molho we haven't gone to yet, but. Yeah, hey, get the fuck out of here, Skullboy! <laughs> <laughs> Mole comes up. What are you? Oh god! I don't think Mumbo's even sure. Is he like a guy from Sesame Street or something? Because he looks like a Muppet. <laughs> the the felt the, the felt pink body makes me think Jim Henson was involved in his creation. This spell brought to you by Letter C. L like he's a d an early Dark Crystal reject for convoluted. All right, let's turn this one on now. Yep, this is Mumbo's job. He is just turning on the power. Oh, he gets the he gets the grounded rides. I like ground rides. I'm a bit of a pansy when it comes to heights, so staying close to the ground, good enough for me. Yeah, we gotta get up on all those stars, and there's the there's the jiggy out at the top, and it's spinning too. Oh, How wonderful. Awesome. Yes. Ooh. Wow, do they want you to platform in here? Wow, that seems hard. Uh, yeah. Good thing I'm not doing that. Best leave it to Baron Bird. <laughs> See ya! <laughs> They'll do it. Mumbo seems like a bit of a trickster. You know, setting up all this stuff. It's like, hey, I made it easier for you. Good luck. I wouldn't say he's a trickster, but I would say he can be uh, a little loose with the truth. It's like, hey, hey Mumbo, did you get everything turned on? Uh, yep, everything's all good. Oh, anything seem particularly hard? Yeah, yes. Yeah, you'll be no, fine. Nothing you can. You'll be you fine. Can. You'll, 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 you'll be fine. He's oddly good at getting us all prepped for everything, but when push comes to shove, he's like, okay, so I didn't really do much. That's all up to you. Maybe Humble was right. He is an amateur. I mean, I mean, what, what did he turn Banjo into? A washing machine, a termite, a pumpkin, a bee... And a fucking crocodile. Well, those were all themed. The, the Humba Wumba, you know, you don't know what she's what she's gonna turn you I, into. I know, it's like a dartboard. Oh, oh uh, yeah, here, here you're uh, you're, a, you're a rock person now. <laughs> oh, oh, wait a minute, you're a, you're a plunger for TNT. Oh, now you're the getaway vehicle. <laughs> Jesus, the cops are here. Go, boys. <laughs> I wonder which area that is. Uh, forty-two. It, say, it says 51, but I think it might be 5-1. Like it, the like, fifth first version of a, like of the a place to go? Like the first quadrant of Area 5. I think that might be it. Pretty sure that's it, yes. Your past self seems sure. Well, sure <laughs> enough, at least. Yeah, this... <laughs> Not really a whole lot Mumbo can do. I, I kind of want to see, like, Mumbo accidentally opens an Elder Tor and he comes back and he says, Oh man, you're up, guys. I did a bad thing. I just did what the pad told me to do. <laughs> <laughs> it said summon Cthulhu. I thought it was a metaphor. Banjo, do not look in eyes. I do not had... look in eyes. I thought there was a cute little rare character called Cthulhu or something. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, su I'm surprised that wasn't a pinata in Viva Pinata. Oh look, a Cthulhu gram. It's a Cthulhu made of graham cracker. All right, before we leave, I do want to get that last move though. You do need this. What could it be? 
Airborne egg aiming! Huh? When you're in the air, you can shoot eggs! Oh, that seems too simple. It seems like it should have been in the first game, don't you think? A little bit. I mean, it's either that or just rocketing yourself towards a target. That sounds dumb. And it almost sounds like that this might be used in the boss of the level or something. Mm. Well, cool. How do we test it? Uh, well, we... I don't think we got anything to test on right now. I mean... Uh, guess we can go back to the wigwam and, uh... <laughs> Turn me back into the... into the getaway vehicle! I need to get out of here! Yeah, we opened some things, we need to get back into the car. <laughs> Make me roadworthy! <laughs> vroom vroom, bitches! Let's go! You have one pop tire. <laughs> it's like, how am I supposed to work like this? <laughs> Actually, you know, before he jumps in, it's like, ah, oh, my ankle's kind of fucked up. Ow, oh, oh, well. ow, <laughs> ow, <laughs> jumps ow. in, it's like a, his hubcap's spinning off. <laughs> you turned me into a piece of trash, Wumba! I should mention you do this by honking the horn. Oh, for opening the doors, or? Yeah, it's you open the doors, it's how you pay for stuff, you just, you just honk. Beep. Ah, here's what I wanted. Ah! Come the, in here. The 20. So we can get the 20, and I... I think that's all 100? Already? Pretty sure, yeah. Oh, cool. So we're like halfway done with this stage. Oh, well, we, now we just gotta get all the jiggies, not that everything's turned on, now that we've got, you know, the Globos taken care of. Mm -hmm. Uh, this'll be fun. You can pay here for that, guy. Bone jarring dodgems. <laughs> oh, God. Well, that sounds like fun. The ride is now open. Pay to play. I think I'll do just that. Next time on Banjo Tooie. Oh, I knew you'd do that. We're gonna be getting more rides and more jiggies and more of Witchy World. But not all of it. How much? Find out next time. See you then. Jesus, boys, let's go!